Can I greet you in the name of Jesus? Amen. Yes. Uh, are you ready for one on one? Yes. You are here. address you and tell you something before we start. Uh, put something in your heart. And one of the things that I always tell our people is that we want to start with one on one. And uh, I was telling my sister that where we come from, uh, in Florida, we finished working yesterday 12 o'clock midnight. Because uh, we, we worked there the whole day almost until 12 o'clock. Uh, when we finished, it was 12 o'clock. You'll understand we are still a bit tired. Mm -hmm. uh, but today, you're about to see Jesus. Amen. Amen. Yes. Amen. 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 You know, many of you, they've been telling you about Jesus. Today, you are about to experience the glory of Jesus. Amen. Yes. Amen. Amen. So, but before we see you, all the time I tell our visitors, you need to know this thing. It's time now to glorify the name of God. Yes. We have a problem. I'll tell you the problem. The problem we have now with our generation is that you believe too much in pastors. Come on. And we sideline Jesus. Even when you come here, some of you say, no, I know that man of God will help me. You're not saying Jesus will help me. Amen. Can you see some of the mistakes that we are doing? Mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm. oh, that man of God will pray for me. I know you're, you're going to be healed. Don't worry. But it's not us. Amen. It's Jesus that will heal you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 We are making a mistake. We are really making a mistake. Let's bring back Jesus to our hearts. Whatever that will happen in, in this meeting, don't ever mention our names. Don't ever say, Prophet Andrew's prayed for me. Apostle Makan is a prayed for Say, Jesus has prayed for me. You know, I, I was telling some people yesterday in Florida, I said, why people, why pastors are not the same? You know, I tried to explain this thing to them. And it's very easy. One of the reasons why we pastors were not the same We've got pastors that are pastors only on Sundays. And we have pastors that are pastors every minute. I'll tell you why. We're carrying the name of Jesus. You know, one of the reasons why a pastor will fight another pastor is because of lack of the spirit of prayer. I believe that, yes. But if you pray enough, even you, God will give you revelations. God will anoint you like other people. The issue is time. How you spend your time. Are you ready to receive something today? Amen. Are you ready to receive something? Amen. 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 So after we pray for you, you know, since I came back, yes, last year we came here, last year, I think it was the same month, and this year we came back, there's been a lot of testimonies. And one thing I know, you can't follow us if you don't have a testimony. Mm -hmm. Now, everybody that you see them following us now is because of a testimony. Yeah. <laughs> you know, when I met this man, I said to him, I see a business. God is going to bless you a lot. I even said to him, this is a real estate business. And nothing was happening at that time. Zero. You know, just for us to leave, something huge happened. 
So now even you, God is about to do something. Amen. Amen. After God bless you, I want to finish now. After God bless you, that money is not for you alone. You must help other people. Yes. Are you going to do that? Yes. Huh? Yes. Some of our blessings have been delayed because our hearts are not generous. Huh? We were Christians, we've been praying for your businesses. They're not moving, isn't it? Check your heart. Are you generous enough? You know, because we've got people that everything good must come to them. But when it's time to share with other people, it becomes very difficult. So now how do you expect God to bless you when you don't have a good heart? So you open your heart. When God makes you a millionaire, because from 2018, I want to tell you something, from 2017, 18, 19, 20, 23, 24, now, we have prayed for many people that are multimillionaires now. Wow. <laughs> and people that are not. Yeah. How many of you know the name Charis? What is the meaning of Charis? Mercy. Huh? Mercy. Mercy. Today you will receive mercy. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 